Alright guys, so surprisingly enough, some of you actually wanted a Gara combo. Yeah, I know, like, Gara, like, who uses Gara? Well, I mean, I guess spammers do. No shade, no shade. But, you know, Gara's actually a pretty good character when he's not being spammed, because, you know, when you go against Gara's, this is all you see. This is all you see when you go against Gara's. So I'm here to actually show you combos that you actually have to put skill into. And with that, let's just get right into the video, guys. See you there. Okay guys, for your first combo, it's 4 light, 3 heavies, on your third heavy, do sand shower and call Rukia, and then do sand shower again. You know, it's kind of ironic, I told people this video is going to be to stop using sand shower a lot, but the first combo is 2 sand showers. Okay, but enough of that, let's go on to the second combo. See you there. Okay guys, so the second combo is 4 light, 3 heavies, sand shower, and then a little bit right after you do sand shower, call Rukia. And then do sand burial. And for this to work, you absolutely have to go right next to them and troll. And then do sand burial again. And that's an easy 40%. I'm just joking about this trolling part, but you know. That's, it's funny, it's funny. Alright, that was a bad joke, I get it. But, yeah guys, that's the second combo. It actually does a lot of damage, but it does take a lot of meters. So make sure you have 5 meters to do it. Alright guys, now let's move on to the third combo. Okay guys, so this third combo is kind of weird. I wouldn't recommend using it just because of how, like weird it is but you know it's five light okay and on the third do your sand tsunami and call rukia and then bam that's how you use sand tsunami i just taught you how to use the most useless move in the game but you know it's it just does like a regular attack it does like what 15 percent 20 percent uh i wouldn't really recommend i wouldn't really recommend using it uh, i don't know what i said before i don't really recommend using it uh, I mean, it looks cool, you know, it's like, who uses sand, sand tsunami, aside from guard breaks, but, um, yeah, guys, it's a combo, so I might as well put it in. Alright, guys, see you at the fourth one. Okay, guys, so for this fourth combo, it's four light, two heavies, and then you do sand burial. And then you do three heavies again, and then you do sand burial again. And then, bam, easy 30%. For four meter, <laughs> yeah. I mean, this combo. I mean, I guess it can be used, but I wouldn't really recommend using it when you're just like at, you know, non awakened, just normal, because it's a lot, a lot for four meter. So I wouldn't really recommend this. But now we're gonna get into the combos that you know start dealing high damage when you're awakened and all that stuff, and it involves your ultimate. So see you there. Okay, guys. So combo five, non awakened, is four light. Two heavies, sand burial, three heavies, sand burial again, and then do your ult right after. Yeah, you heard me. Just, just do your ult. <laughs> like it connects. It actually connects. If you guys didn't know that, I got you with the strats and all that. I got you, bro. Okay, so as you can see, uh, non awaken it does around 40%. And if you're new to the channel then I usually do these combos that involve your ultimate. I do them non-awakened and then awakened to show you the difference in the amount of damage it does just in case you're in a scenario where it's like, you know, do or die. Like, I have to do this combo right now. So, um, yeah, so right now I'll do the combo awakened. So, I'll see you there. Okay, guys, so combo 5 version 2 with awakened is 4 light, 2 heavies, sand burial, 3 heavies again, sand burial, and then your ultimate. <laughs> and the the, uh, the difference in damage is actually pretty nice now that I think about it. It's actually a really good combo. Like look at this. This is a good. That's a good 60% combo without assist. So if you ever like if you ever just use your assist or something, and you have to do this combo, I will recommend doing this. It's actually a pretty good combo. Not gonna lie. All right, guys. Now let me show you combo six. Okay guys, so combo 6 is 4 light, 3 heavies, and on your 3rd heavy, do Rukia assist, and sand shower, and then do your ultimate. And I'm not gonna lie, yo, Gaara's ultimate comes out faster now, ever since the, ever since the patch. Uh, I actually like it now, you know, Gaara is viable again. And, um, you know, that's a good 45% non-awakened, so now, you know, like I explained before, I'm gonna do the awakened version, so I'll get to that right now. Okay guys, so combo 6, version 2, while awakened is 4 light, 3 heavies, call rookie assist while doing sand shower, and then do your ultimate. And then, yo, I'm not gonna lie, this combo, this 
combo goes hard, bro. This combo is nasty. Like, yeah, I like it. I like it. Look at this damage. That's a good 70% uh, right there. That's 70% combo with Gara. And it's actually pretty good if you're, if you're not trying to do anything like really fancy or hard and all that. That's the standard combo that I would use. You know, if you're just doing it, doing it against a, a fight and you know that you know you got the timing down with Rukia, just like just do it on the third heavy. If you if you got it all down, it's a really easy combo, really simple, hard hitting, and um, you know, just good. I recommend this combo the most out of every every one. And if you think that's the last combo, you're wrong, because there's actually a combo after this that I invented. It's kind of useless because it only does like five more percent, but still, it's a combo. Okay, guys, so I'll show you that right now. Okay, guys, for combo seven, it's four light, three heavies, sand shower. Call Rookie a little bit after sand shower. Here's sand burial, spin troll like there's no tomorrow. Do sand burial again, and then do your ultimate. <laughs> And you might be thinking, whoa, this combo is actually broken. You know, so much damage. But it's actually that, um, you know, the way they design Jump Force is that you can't do too much damage. Because if you just do all these, like, 70% combos without your ultimate already, and then you add your ultimate on top of it and do, like, 40%, then that just, like, it goes over. Like, it's an instant kill if you land the combo. So they actually, like, um, they designed the game in such a way that you can't do too much damage. So they, like, they, once you... Do the sand burial and then you do your ultimate you know how your ultimate's supposed to do 30 percent well yeah now it only does like what like five percent damage and all that because they want to you know measure it out you know checks and balances and all that stuff so that's why i don't really recommend this combo it looks fancy it does a little bit extra damage but i don't really recommend it look now let me show you the awakened version to show you what i'm talking about okay guys so combo seven while awakened four late three heavies Sand shower, a little bit after sand shower, call Rukia. Sand burial, spin troll like there's no tomorrow. Sand burial again, and then do your ultimate. Bro, that right there is a good enough combo. Like, I'm serious, and all that stuff. Um, yeah, Yo, you see, look, look at how much damage it does. You see, it only did like 5%. If you if you did this like raw, like raw weakened ultimate, that would do like 20%, because that's like the huge hitting part of the combo. But to balance it out, you know, they lower the damage on it once you like combine it with the other moves. So you see, it does a little bit more, like 5%. This is like a 75% combo. I wouldn't really recommend it. You have to get the timing down. I would really just rather use combo six, the one where you call, where you do sand shower, call rookie, and then do your ultimate. Easy damage, easy 70%. That's the one I recommend the most out of this when you're trying to evolve your ultimate. And yeah, guys, now time to go online and look for A-Rank Sweaties. So uh, I'll I'll be back as soon as the video starts. Well, the video, the fight starts. Wow, I, I keep messing up today in my words. Okay, guys, see you there. Hi, right, guys. So we found a person, and we're going to let him hit me until I get my red meter. So I'll see you guys when I get to do the combo. So deuces for like now even though I'll see you in like a second <laughs> alright guys so we actually let him have that round so now we're at red and now we should be able to do the combo if this guy doesn't like escape every 10 seconds or go really try hard okay perfect alright pop okay call Rukia everything's going according to plan Oh, and this is a weak point, so I got to see how much it does against Sasuke. So, it's gonna be some good damage. Bop. And I guess we'll end off this video with just take winning this round and all that stuff. Alright. Say a word. Fuck! No! I try to end it off cool. I try to do the. the I'll, I'm gonna try to get him into like the the coffin, and then just like uh, the sand burial, and then just like troll spin. No, stop going. Try hard. Oh my god, I'm serious. Come on, dodge. I want him to dodge. Oh my god. Yo, this guy. Oh my god. Actually, now nah, we're gonna end it off cool. We're gonna finish this whole match. We're gonna finish this whole match. We're gonna end this off cool. Let's go, come on. 
come on. Nope. Yep. Yeah. Bop. Look at this. You got a troll spin to make it super effective. Bop. Well, now you get to see both of them. <laughs> both of them weak point attacks. Look at y'all. New tree. <laughs> and then, bam. Good damage, good damage, good damage. Wait. Don't think I get hit by that. Oh, I. Nope. Oh, why don't we use the sand tsunami? The sand tsunami one. I want to use that one. That one is cool. No, I try to chase him. Yeah, this game sucks, bro. Nah, I'm kidding. Chill. Come on. No. Come on. What the fuck is this? Fuck you. Wait, that doesn't connect. I'm dead. Well, whatever. I want. <laughs> Alright guys, if you enjoyed the video, please make sure to leave a like, please make sure to leave a comment. Uh, yeah guys, just have a good day. It's like 2am for me right now and I have school. I got 7, so uh, I'm pretty tired. I think I'm just going to knock out and edit this later. But um, yeah guys, hope you enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, all that YouTuber cliche stuff. I appreciate every single one of you. Have a great day and deuces.